few inches you can pass it by. So there's the oak. Do you think we were much further along? Somewhere in this area is where we came up. Yeah. There's another oak further up. And by my estimations, I think you were about, well, somewhere between that oak and that oak. Can you see the other one there? Yes. Just a bit further up. There's only really, there's only really two oaks that are on that side of the, the present day fence. That's that one and this next one up here. My, my perception was that it was over there as opposed to here. Yeah. Into the field. Oh yeah, I'm just trying yeah. to I'm just trying to work out where where the, well, the, the, I mean, the route onto the seen field. That stupid monument they've yeah, got. Yeah. A lot of people say that was where a bit too far north. It, it, it is, yeah. It's a crazy place. Um, but yeah, it's uh, Despite all these years that have passed, it's, it's still controversial. Uh, where the actual, I mean, John Burroughs has identified at least three different places. I've Most yeah. Most of them along here, though. Yes. Yeah, so the... What 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 strikes me is that some of them are in the forest and some of them are out in the open out there. Yeah, yeah. Which is bizarre. I mean, I, I guess it's difficult to, to remember these kind and of then, things. Of course, uh, John Burroughs ended up chasing the lighthouse, which was um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was, that was just one of these things. Okay, we would have Cow come packs. out probably somewhere right along in here. Yeah. Yeah. If it helps you to orientate yourself. There should be a picnic table down that's, there. That's right. There's a yards. path there. There's a sign. You can actually just see the path there. There's a path there and, and a sign. That's where most people look out onto the field when they're doing the UFO mm -hmm. trail. There's another oak tree just behind here. And I think... I suspect you were somewhere between that oak tree and that oak tree. It was somewhere in this area, yes. Yeah. So where we would have seen the object in the for or the indentations in the forest would have been back in here. Yeah. And I put some surveyor's tape on a tree three years ago. Yeah. It's long gone now, I guess. I'm sure the Forest Service people have taken it down. Maybe, or... I mean, Now, do we feel it was closer? I, I, I know, I know you, it, it's only an estimate, but do we think it was closer to that oak tree over there? <clears throat> you can just about see one there as well, yeah, just, no, just behind there. there. It was in here somewhere, where he came up to the fence. Do you remember whether that, that track was there? That track runs off kind of that way at an angle. So we didn't go down there. We came yeah. in here, yeah. we went up, went out there. Yeah. And we came back, we came back here, and went back and back up. Yeah. I'm guessing since you came back afterwards and saw the oak tree there, I'm, I'm getting the sense that perhaps you were closer to that oak tree? Closer to it, I think. Should, should we work our way back? Just try and get a rough... What I've never been able to understand is yeah, go this. On. If this is where we are, yeah, and that's the oak tree, yeah? Yeah. And that's Capel Green, yeah? Yeah. And we got here, there's the runway, yeah? There's Folly House there. Yes. You walk along here, up there. That is allegedly what everybody says is Area 1, which is um, the photograph shown by Georgina Broom. Yeah. And where Brenda says, since they've taken the trees down, was where there was a landing spot there. And I can't get me head around it. Yeah. Just, well, just... the interesting thing is, we know for a fact, Penniston came back the next morning and made yeah. plaster casts, mm -hmm. one of which I have. Yeah. <clears throat> I took soil samples. And a British friend of mine took some soil samples that came out, and he had them analyzed. And he said, aha, they used, I find calcium carbonate in the soil. I said, yes, guess what the main ingredient in plaster is? Yeah. See, Penniston's landlord was a plasterer, of coincidentally. So he borrowed five pounds and a bucket of water and came out here and made the three casts. So I know I went to the site that he took the plaster casts from because the worst fell some yes. carbonate. So and that was the next day, so it must be pretty... He did that pretty... the next morning, and then the yeah. following night is the night I came out. Yeah. So I was probably taken to the place that he says was the original landing site. Now, several years later, we were back, and he took us to different places up by the gate. Yeah. But keep in mind, he was drugged and, and administered sodium amaryl or sodium pentothal, Lord knows what. But, uh, the OSI and the CIA are authorized 450 different chemicals to use on people with authorizations, including LSD. I find the list of them. Nick Pope did. It's on his website. Yeah, I've seen it, yeah. They're also authorized to use hypnosis under certain conditions with authorization. 
which wouldn't have been hard to guess in this particular yeah. case. Now, Burroughs was seen going into the OSI office right after it happened in uniform by two people. He told me at one time he was drugged and hypnotized. Now he says he wasn't. Penniston remembers the people drugging and hypnotizing him. He remembers a naval officer being there, which makes sense because <clears throat> the military divides up the world for different responsibilities. Intelligence responsibility for the UK is the British. So a naval officer out of the embassy would have made sense being there instead of a U.S. Air Force officer or yeah. an Army officer or something. So that kind of fits. Don't know. Yeah. Th I wasn't there. Th th I know that trying to put to piece together, as I have done recently, where things happened, it's very difficult because there's a lot of confusion, there's a lot of misinformation. It's, it's well, a lot of times passed, too. And it's a long time ago. If you'd have exactly. asked me 30 years ago, I could have taken you probably very, very close yeah. to the site. Yeah. And, and things would have been very similar. Then after the forest got knocked down and everything, you know. Yeah, of course. And a whole lot of other people got involved, and there's supposed to be a UFO up here. They still have it up They've there? They've got the sculpture, yeah. yeah. They've got the sculpture yeah. up there, yeah. <laughs> but what is the association with this here? What is the association with that? Nothing that I know of. But they say that that's where the famous Georgina Bruni photograph yeah. with, the, with the PC Creswell yeah. that's walking around like this. Yeah, and I know the photo, yeah. Creswell would have been the right guy. Mm -hmm. I know him. Yeah. And Mike Verano was... Uh, he was the operations officer right. for the school. Well, I don't understand. I mean, I accept that they've taken the trees down because it's all part of forestry development. Yeah. But, but, but I'm telling is you, this is where I was brought when I yes. came out. I yeah. mean, it's, it, some people say that the thing came in... The thing came in here... Yeah. And then went over there. What uh, they have? I don't know. Yeah, we, we, there's so much... Uh, it, it, Look, all these years later, I'm confused. It is it is very confusing. One of the things as to confusion as well, we talked about the time, we've talked about you know the, just the general confusion surrounding the witnesses. Another thing is, there were other events. That, that's the thing. You've got other people saying that certain things happened before, afterwards. Oh, there's um, another report. I, I was talking to, to Michael Stacey Smith just a, just a couple of days <laughs> oh, <yeah>. ago. <laughs> Who? Uh, Michael Stacy Smith. He's the one I, I sent you his email. Chuck. Remember, he's not oh, yeah, I talk with him. 